Um, hey everyone, and welcome back to another video. Um, this was requested, but I'm sorry it took so long. I am going to be showing you how to build your own model airport terminal. Um, like the kind of the materials you need. For this example, I'm going to be building Austin's South Terminal. Um, I haven't built a terminal for it yet, but I am going to now. So, let's get started. First thing you want to do is, um, research your airport. You know, make sure you know what it looks like. My advice is, um, get a good look at it on Google Earth. Now, in my case, it's, it's a pretty small terminal. However, there's unique features such as, you know, it's maybe more of a longer, more rectangular terminal. There's a bit of a thing sticking out. And just try to get ideas what you're going to do. I think I might use um, Q-tips or toothpicks to hold those little, um, those, uh, those poles up. And maybe even tissues for the top. Um, to try to get a good idea of what it looks like. And on the outside, I'm going to show you my, the main terminal here, which I've already built. Um, in my updates, again, I made the curve. And yeah. Um, in my case, I am using cardboard. You can use wood. It just takes a while. Um, so in this case, I am going to be using cardboard. Next, you're going to want to pick out a um, texture to use for your airport. Um, my advice is you get a Google Doc for it, uh, don't want that, um, you want a Google Doc for it, um, normally I just copy it, um, copy the image, and then put it onto my Google Slides, which, there we go, um, my advice is trying to get the whole page, um, there. So um, then after this, you print it out, which I will do in a second. Now, um, I'm going to be doing a voiceover now because this is a time lapse part. But what you're going to want to do, you're going to want to cut out the area of the airport, which means you're going to like take the cardboard and cut out you know the area of where the building is going to stand in my case I have a building in one separate area so here you can see me kind of struggling a bit but um, yeah you just lay out the area try to cut it out as best as you can maybe even use a sharpie but yeah I also would recommend using a box knife as it is easier than using scissors and it's also quicker even though I'm pretty bad at using them it's still faster so I just finished making the outline, um, in fact this part is actually going to be the roof um, in the finished product. I was struggling with the pocket knife, or the box knife, but um, I, did, I did cut it out. Things will get a bit easier from here, um, but uh, this is going to be the roof and you're going to see, um, except that part is going to be the bottom, but the main part of the terminal, this is just going to be the roof, so yeah. And now for the secret ingredient. Masking tape. Um, next up, you're going to want to build the walls of the building, which you use masking tape. Um, you cut out another piece of board, and the height of this will determine how high your building will be. Um, here, here I am cutting it out. Sometimes it is a bit hard to get the angle on, um, but my advice is put tape on the inside, put tape on the outside of the corners. Um, you don't need this, but, uh, we got a food delivery, a uh, smoothie. It's like super hot up here, so this is going to be helpful.
I've just finished the, um, almost like the boarding area. Um, in real life, there's like, almost like tarp on top. So I, I recreated that, which um, I, I'm personally proud of. But next we're gonna um, do some stuff to the terminal and then we'll be done. Now this part is the easiest part. You just cut out the pieces of paper that you printed out earlier and then you just glue them onto the terminal. Um, not much really to explain here. And here is the finished project of the Austin South Terminal. Uh, we have that waiting area in the main terminal here. Um, there, that's also part of the finished project over there. If it will zoom in, that mess. But um, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like and don't forget to subscribe if you are not already. If you did make it to the end of the video, thank you, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.